we finally got out of that plane. So, the next thing is going to the museum. The cop won't let me. A what? Oh. Okay. An empty glass bottle with a screw cap. Let's pick it up. Hmm, what else do we have here? Poster. Oh, magazine. Time magazine. Nope. Take that. And what's here? Glass. A piece of glass. Okay, take that as well. We'll need it. Okay, let's talk. The owner seems to be a real patriot. Looks busy. Hmm. <laughs> he doesn't look busy. Hello. Hello, all. lovely lady. How can I make your visit to the Palace of Fine Arts even sweeter today? I would like something to read. Got any interesting papers? Of course. I've got Military Magazine and a few other publications of a more uh, delicate nature, if you catch my name. No, not interesting. Interesting enough for you? No. Not for me, thanks. The customer is king. Anything else I can do for you today? Yeah, something do to eat, maybe? food as well? Unfortunately, my hot dog machine is shot. But I have a nice selection of candy bars and salted nuts. No, thanks. I had that on the plane already. Suit yourself. Anything else I can do for you? Mm, yeah, maybe some alcohol. <laughs> Come to think of it, I'd like something to drink. How about an iced tea? Very refreshing. Well... Sorry, I don't carry German beer. You don't want to raise any eyebrows. <laughs> Brows, get it? You're a regular Roger Moore. Yes, people who live in Germany only drink beer. Schnell, give me three liters of the stuff immediately. You can't just buy alcohol anywhere, you know. Why ever not? You aren't really expecting me to give you a lecture on California's alcohol laws, are you? The only thing you need to know is that I don't sell alcohol here because I'm not allowed to. It's that simple. So do you want an alcohol-free iced tea or not? Oh, all right. Perhaps if I snort it, I'll get some kind of buzz. Honestly, the customer service here. Bye-bye. Have a good one, lady. <laughs> In my country, you can buy alcohol anywhere you want. <laughs> okay, so we need to get rid of the cop. Yeah, let's... I have an idea. The tea looks a lot more appetizing in a bottle. Yeah, let's frame this man. I mean, we need to... Oh. Okay, I cut the whiskey bottle label out of the front page. I sense that's all I'll need. Nice, and let's label it. The label wouldn't stick. Oh. I think she do have a glue or something. Oh. An ordinary American bottle. Okay, let's wet it. I'll moisten the label a little. Now it's wet. Should stick to the bottle, at least until it dries. And let's place it here. I just hope it doesn't see me. No, what? What you doing? If I approach from the side, I can place my whiskey bottle in between the other wares without being noticed. Okay, she has done it. Let's talk to the cop. Officer. Hello, officer. Hi, it's me again. How can I help you, ma'am? I have something to report. But let's ask about museum. Could I take a quick look at the museum? Sorry, ma'am, but like I said, the museum is closed due to a fire. All those masterpieces... gone? The paintings are safe. They were secured in the fireproof basement archive. Oh, so I need to break in. May I ask you something? Isn't that what you've been doing this whole time? It's because of the strict <laughs> alcohol laws here in California. I don't want to make a mistake in getting wasted. Alcohol is only sold in special liquor stores during legally mandated opening hours, and only to customers who are over 21 years old. So, you can't just buy a bottle off the street? Of course not. 
Are things different where you're from? Well, you can buy just about anything just about anywhere. In every supermarket, at any gas station, even the smallest kiosk carries a wide selection. Just in case. Are you so just talking like about my alcohol? Too. Or can you buy firearms too? No, not firearms, just... Alcohol drinks. I have drinks. to ask you about liquor licenses again. What about them? How do I recognize a licensed shop? That's easy. Liquor stores have a sign over the door that says, Liquor Store. You can't miss it. <laughs> really? So, I can assume that the kiosk over there isn't allowed to sell alcohol. Yes, ma'am. He can't sell you any alcohol. Licensed liquor stores have to be burglar-proof. That's why the kiosk doesn't have the sign I mentioned. But I saw alcohol in its display. Say that again? Well... I don't know that much about it. I only drink beer from time to time, but what I saw over there looked suspiciously like a bottle of the devil's juice. Whiskey. Well, if that's true, then I'll have to take a closer look. Yes, you do that. Oh, he's an idiot. <laughs> I'm sure the officer will realize that it's just a harmless joke. At least I hope so for the shopkeeper's sake. Trunk. Let's open the trunk. Let's see if we can find the something officer useful. Is out. A good opportunity to steal everything from the trunk. I'll oh, everything I might be able to use. Kiosk is closed. <laughs> and I'll close it quietly. Is that all? Yeah, I think so. Okay, museum is in my next stop. Entrance poster. Advertising the Leonardo da Vinci exhibition. And I know the painting on the poster all too well. The Madonna Benoit. According to the sticker, the emergency generator is behind that door. The door is secured by a fat padlock. Can I? Yeah, I think I can. Off with the padlock. <laughs> The generator is off. No shit. It's not starting, but what engine would without fuel? Oh, fuel. It's made to be filled from a nozzle. I'll pour it all over the place otherwise. Hmm. Okay. To the museum, I guess. The cop said the paintings were all secured. I have to find the Madonna Benoit and hope Archimedes proof is still in sight. So we need to start the generator. Okay, let's see. Ah, go up. Hmm. Stairs. Okay. Looks like the fire might have broken out in the room behind this door. Can I get in? Utterly bent. I won't be able to open it, not even with a crowbar. Oh, there's that flying machine from the dream. <laughs> a window. Yeah, I can go out to the window. It's a long time since I last climbed along the outside of a public building. Come on. Oh, window. <laughs> Fire really tore through here. Drawer. There's a basic lock on the drawer. Open it. Appears to be locked. Oh, it figures. All a victim of the fire. Land. The fire didn't do it much good. Oh, I can probably use watering can for the generator frame of glasses a let's take glasses that up frame. yep and I'm sure I can quick lock this drawer of course because I'll be able to pick a lock with a pair of glasses all right I'll give it a try and you made it imagine that it worked but there's nothing useful in here apart from a thin metal card. Yeah, just metal card. No one will ever be able to use a key with that again. 
Okay, I think there's nothing left here. Let's get out. Window. So let's start the generator. Stairs. Come on. Exit. Okay. Let's fill. I've poured the diesel this can into the watering fuel. can. Diesel. It's the same. No. Oh. Okay, I, I just hope it works. It should work. Perfect fit. You won't spill a drop. Yeah, yeah. Let's start it. Chugging away, supplying power to the museum. Okay, let's get back. And I think we need to find the vault. Safe vault. I'm not sure. Oh. And I suppose it's down the stairs. Yep. Fu fuse box. A little small. And the lights are all power. The fuse for the lights. Hmm. There's no power on the sockets now. There's power on the sockets. The lights are working now, but the sockets have blown. Looks like the emergency generator isn't capable of generating enough power for both the lights and the sockets. Oh, I see. The lights went off again. There's power on the sockets. Okay. Let's open this door. And then turn the lights back on. Did it. The way to the archive is clear. Now I need the lights. The lights are working now, but the sockets have blown. Looks like the emergency generator isn't capable of generating enough power for both the lights and the sockets. Yeah. Let's get in. Bingo. Da Vinci's painting must be stored somewhere here. Garden variety wooden boxes. Full of stuff I don't need. Hmm. The crates don't contain anything interesting. Okay, lamp. It's missing the shade, otherwise the lamp seems to be fine. A lamp. How useful. Yeah. Hmm. I think here. Oh, no. All the artwork is being safely stored in there. With any luck, the Madonna Benoit will be among them. It must be like hundreds of paintings and stuff there. An x-ray machine used to analyze exhibits. Among other things, it can be used to verify their authenticity. Really? That must be Anderson's desk. The restorer Max was supposed to meet here. I wonder what information he had for Max. I wonder myself An extremely that tidy desk. There's nothing here I could use. That's us the computer. The computer isn't booting. Probably because there's no power on the sockets. Oh, yeah. Shit. We, we need to find the light. I have light here, but I have no idea where to plug it. No. There must be something here. This. Oh, there's a socket. I'll plug in the cable. Unfortunately, there's no power on the socket. Yeah. It's plugged in now. Let's turn the power. Come on. Why did you close the door? Uh. The sockets should work now, but the lights are blown. Looks like the emergency generator isn't capable of supplying yeah, yeah, blah, blah, the blah, lights blah. and the sockets at the same time. I know that. Come on. Let's find out that this picture. Room has no windows, I can't see a thing. Oh yeah. Nice. Fast boot. If I keep switching that on and off, it's going to blue screen the hell out of me. No, no, I'm sorry. 
Uh, okay, search the archive. Hmm, what should I do? I'm not sure. Which oh. painting should I search for? Madonna Benoit. Benoit. Or Which Benoit artist should Francis. I search for? Benoit. Something like that. Da Vinci. Which year of origin should I select? 15th century. Yes. I know now where the Madonna Benoit is being kept. I'll go and get it. It's a maze in there, but I found what I was looking for. I wonder what secret this painting holds. Come on, say the name of the painting. I wanna know how to pronounce it. <laughs> of course. Anderson x-rayed the painting and discovered Da Vinci's secret. It can't be all that difficult. I'll give it a try. What's that? What happened here? My friend, you wish to speak with me? My king? Oh, there is no need to bow, Archimedes. I may be powerful, but my name will one day be forgotten. I am confident that yours will survive the ages. Your messenger informed me that you've made a remarkable discovery. Indeed. Look here. What do you see? A circle. In order to mount a wheel, one must know its circumference. In order to decorate a column with a wreath, one must know the column's circumference. All of this can only be accomplished with the mathematical constant we call pi, which, until now, has been estimated as best we can. No one knows how to calculate this number more precisely. And you have found the formula? Oh, well, uh, very good. <laughs> Our builders will thank you for it. Pardon me, my king, but this formula goes far beyond practical applications. It is the key to eternity. You speak in riddles. This mathematical constant is difficult to comprehend. It consists of more numbers than there are stars in the heavens. Calculating this number down to the very last decimal place will require time. The circle is a symbol of natural perfection. Those who learn the mathematical constant of the circle to its very last digit will unlock the secrets of our world. If we can decipher this number, we will gaze upon the very faces of the gods. You have always been a loyal friend to me, and you know that I trust your judgment. Uh, if you need an assistant to aid you with this calculation, just say the word. Not one, my king. Calculating this number will take more time than the construction of the pyramids. We will need thousands. My god, these visions are getting increasingly strange. Was Archimedes right? Does Pi contain a secret? You not come in, Pi? Anderson? No, he disappeared, along with your fiance. Max, what happened to him? The same thing that was going to happen to you before I got involved. Didn't you notice you were being monitored? By whom? I'll explain later. You have to come to me at the- Where? Hello! Are you there? Apparently not. A let's see what this is. QR code. A QR code. Okay, let's scan it. I can scan QR codes like that with my cell phone. Hmm, Cassandra. That name was in the email Max got from that restorer. 
If I remember correctly, Cassandra is a tragic figure in Greek mythology who foresaw every calamity, but could find no one who would listen to her. Not exactly a good omen, but it's my only lead. 